Oppositional Defiant Disorder is a childhood mental health condition involving disruptive behavior. It includes a long-standing pattern of defiant and argumentative behavior, vindictiveness towards others, and a frequent, irritable, angry mood. This disorder can make it very challenging to form relationships or even interact with other people. This is Community Activate Mental Cinemas. This episode was recommended by Randy Mayo. Welcome. In this series, I'm attempting to match fictional characters with very real mental conditions. The mission is not to exploit the afflicted, but to bring a level of awareness, understanding, and compassion, and to open a conversation on black mental wellness in our communities. In this episode, I'm talking about oppositional defiant disorder. The film is a 1995 film, The Jersey Drive, and the character is Gabriel Cassius's character, Midget. Here are five signs Midget had oppositional defiant disorder. He had a disregard for the law. Your boy Midget and his crew were out here playing Grand Theft Auto real life back in the 90s. And his man was like, yo, you're not getting no money for no cop car. And he was like, it's not about the money. I'm still not sure what it was about. Was it the thrill or was it about embarrassing law enforcement? Either way, your boys was gone in 60 seconds. He was argumentative. What you looking at me for? How you feeling, man? Chill, I got five minutes down here, man. What's up? You want some of this? Want some of what? What's that? You want some of this? Here. Yeah, some of this. This, this was pretty reckless even for Midget and a waste of a 40. But when he threw that bottle, everybody took flight because they know when backup arrives, it ain't gonna be pretty. And his man is in the background telling him to chill, chill, but Midget ain't got no chill. He had disdain for authority. This right here is when you really start to see how off midget really is. I mean, it's one thing to steal cars and to throw 40s, but letting off shots at cops is a quick way to end up with a life of three hots in a cot. He was impatient. No, I'm taking it. No, I'm taking it. What? So, you chilling with your mans, and he just gets up and says, yo, I'm gonna take that car. Hops out and takes it. Midget was a predator. And whenever he seen the opportunity to take something, that's exactly what he did. Strong arm, broad daylight with him, it's whatever. He blamed others for his misbehavior. I'm your right hand, man. This is me, man. You ain't tell me nothing, man. You just... no, I ain't waiting around for you to catch up with me, you know what I'm saying? You plan me, man. You plan me, man. But you know, alright. This this was after he left his man in the parking lot looking dummy during the carjacking. His man was confused partly because Midget told him earlier that he had made some money that he didn't really get. But by his man's reaction, I don't think he was really surprised by what Midget did. A conduct disorder can be caused by family dysfunction. I crashed at Midget's crib a couple times before. It's all right when it's just him and his grandmoms. But when all his brothers are out of jail at the same time, it's a different story. This, this right here gives us a little glimpse into Midget's backstory. He's living in a projects with his grandmother and his three brothers are always in and out of prison. So 
we can kind of assume that he didn't have such a stable upbringing. Complications of oppositional defiant disorder include some of the following. Relationship difficulties. Employment issues. Addiction. And legal issues. They say, if you obey all the rules, you'll miss all the fun. Y'all think Midget had oppositional defiant disorder? An undiagnosed mental condition that let him down a dead end street? Or was it a case of boys being boys? Let me know in the comments below. Diagnose Midget. If you enjoyed this video, hit like and subscribe for more like it. I'll be posting a new one every Sunday evening. And check out some of the older ones. Feedback is always welcome. Thanks for watching. This is Kino from Community Activate Mental Cinemas. Be well.